Navarro. Um, I'm originally from Santa Barbara, California. Um, if you don't know, it's a very beautiful little beach town. <laughs> Wish I was there. Um, but I am working at the Partnership for Secure America with Andy Semmel, Nate Sermonis, and former Scoville fellow Audrey Williams, who are here tonight. And um, let me first say thank you to everyone who spoke this evening about Pete Scoville's life. It was one thing to learn about him and read about his work, but to hear some more anecdotes of his personal life was really helpful for me to sort of understand who he was as a person, so thank you. And I've been at the Partnership for Secure America for all of one week, so I don't have a huge update for you. Um, but I, it's been a very welcoming experience. Everybody in the Scoville family has been extremely helpful, whether it be emails or phone conversations about where I should go and what I should do with the fellowship. Everyone's been extremely helpful, so thank you. And I would like to also thank Paul again. Um, he's been instrumental in making this whole process happen. And thank you to the board for also believing in me. And I'm very excited to hopefully accomplish everything that these three have done over the next six to nine months. So thank you. Good evening, everyone. Um, on my tiptoes too. <laughs> I'm Werda Khalid. I am from Houston, Texas. Woo and I am currently, I've just finished about oh, a little over a month at FCNL, the Friends Committee on National Legislation, where I am working on Middle East policy, specifically issues like Iran, Iraq, Syria, ISIS, Israel, Palestine, you know, light stuff. <laughs> no big deal. Um, and since I've been there, I have been amazed, and I shouldn't be surprised after looking around this room and seeing all the amazing people that are here, about the wonderful people um, that I'm getting to work with, specifically my supervisor, Kate Gould, and Diane Randall, uh, who's also on the board, and also the amazing work that I've been able to do. Since I've started there, I have already published an op-ed, I've been on live TV, I've spoken with Senator Cruz about ISIS. Uh, that was week two. Welcome, welcome. <laughs> um, and yeah, it's just been absolutely amazing, and I can't wait to see what you know the next eight months hold for me. So thank you very much to the board for believing in me. Uh, it has always been a dream of mine to come and work in DC. So thank you for making that happen. Thank you to the donors who support all of us. Thank you to all of you for being a part of the community and for being so welcoming to all of us and to Paul for being our go-to guy, <laughs> Zoe as well. Um, so thank you so much and um, I appreciate everything. I'm so honored and humbled to, humbled to be a part of this. Thank you. Hi, I'm uh, John Rodriguez and uh, like Warda, I've been a fellow for about a month. I'm working at the Center for National Policy with uh, Leo Neal, Mike Breen, and former Scoville fellow Kerry Kramer. Um, and I've mainly been working on uh, counterterrorism policy. And before I uh, come to, to uh, work at CNP and Scoville fellow, I was just finished up my master's degree at, at Georgetown. But before that, I was uh, an infantry officer in the Army and I did a year in the Korngal Valley. And so my experience there is what uh, drives me to work towards better solutions uh, to solve the national security challenges facing the United States. And so I'm really just thankful uh, to the Scoville Fellowship for giving me the opportunity to work on those issues at uh, CMP. Thanks. <laughs> 